Hi, my name is Sammy Shield, and you're watching Pattaya Channel. Who's Okay, go. Matthijs, Matthijs, laat me dat zo meteen doen na het interview. Geef, geef ze in drie minuten en dan doen we na het interview. Oké, okay. Yes, Golden Glory has been around for 13 years now. Um, and we have established a lot of world champions around the world in, in the style of stand-up fighting and also in mixed martial arts. Um, and it has grown internationally. We have gyms in Berlin, Germany, uh, Holland, a few gyms. We have a gym in Thailand now, obviously. We have a gym in England. We have a gym in Bucharest, uh, Romania. Um, and uh, we're exporting other countries now as well. And, and it's, uh, it's, it's really busy. I have two big brothers and uh, they were always practicing karate. So as a little girl, I was always looking to my uh, big brothers uh, how they were practicing their kicks in the garden. And my grandfather was uh, the first, one of the first jiu-jitsu trainers in the Netherlands. And um, one day uh, I had to go to school when I was uh, 12 to the different school and I, a big part was through a forest. And because my friends went to a different school than I did, I had to go on a bike. And it was very scary if you're a 12 year old girl and it's night and you heard the trees like hey, hey, hey. And there were always stories about guys showing, you know, their, uh, their stuff. So I thought I have to learn how to defend myself. Cyborg, now I was, that was like, that was really survival of the fittest for me. <laughs> the hair, I cannot remember that much of that fight. The only thing I can remember was that she hit so incredibly hard. I've never been hit hard, that hard in my entire life. And after the fight, my head was like this big jello pudding face I had. And, but it was a great fight because it taught me I'm a fighter and I'm a true fighter and I will never ever give up. So actually I lost that fight. But I'm very proud of that fight because no one has done what I have done. Nobody stood that many rounds and I didn't give up. And, and she's caught for using PEDs and, you know, that's, it wasn't a fair fight. So I'm, I'm proud of that fight. Uh, I started uh, karate when I was uh, eight years old. After uh, karate, I went to the MMA and after that I went to the kickboxing. I like uh, the karate uh, background, the karate style and uh, like uh, the glory there is now, the kickboxing. That's the, the platform I can, uh, I can show these things. Yeah. So the kickboxing is, for me, the kickboxing is all around. Everything comes together. And uh, if I see in Muay Thai a good knee, yeah. I want to use it in my style. Okay, I like kneeing, of course, uh, punching. Basically, every technique you can finish, I like. And every technique is possible for finish. And look, uh, in this level uh, I'm fighting, uh, every fighter got his talent. And even if he is small, then uh, I think he can uh, work uh, at his advantage for him like uh, my height is my advantage for me so i think every fighter on this level has its advantage <laughs> 